between myriad dimensions. It was once plagued by divine conflict, but saviors from beyond were able to stem that eternal blight. The strife ended, the world was to fade from existence. And yet... An arcane power acted upon it, bestowing these remains with purpose once more. Thus it shines. The dawn of a new era, one where battle reigns supreme. Ignis? Ma? <sighs> Must be Gladio's doing. <sighs> hmm. What? Where did I... Uh huh? You the welcoming committee? You okay? <laughs> Wait. Are you real? <laughs> What's it look like? Hmm. <sighs> I'm sure you can figure it out. <sighs> I gotta be dreaming. Sorry, but you're wide awake. <sighs> First timer, huh? So then, you're from around here? However, others like us should be here. There's others? <sighs> like him. Is that you, Lightning? And he is... Hey there. A new ally. Welcome to the fight. Ally? Uh, hold on. I thought it was finished. We have been called upon to serve a new purpose. By Cosmos? No. By the heiress of her will. Serve what new purpose? I'll explain on the way. You're coming too. Seriously? Hmm. We shall go and seek an audience with her.
Here again? It has been too long, my friend. Likewise. Hey! Zidzadon! Let me guess. You're headed that way. Think I'll tag along. Sure. Hmm. Why does his path diverge? <laughs> I got brought here again? I can't believe this. And what's with that girl following me? Do I have to deal with her? Fine, let's see what she wants. Ah, so your travels were but wayward. <laughs> hmm? <laughs> Death and doom! Forgot to behead that returner! Doom and death. No, I didn't. Let's not stay in the battlefield! As long as it doesn't stain my breeches! Never change. It is beings like him that thrive in this chaos. If it's barbarians like him who live through the fight, I'll need to devise a plan that's utterly airtight. Throw us a bone and come down from your throne. Thank you all for coming here. It could not have been easy. I am pleased, however, that you answered my call. Huh? I am Materia. Huh? Materia? What the? Huh. Uh, who? Beats me. It is my purpose to deliver this world from the grip of the Void, to prevent its destruction. I am the manifestation of order and harmony in this realm. A god, if you will. A god? <gasps> Materia. Yes? You speak of preventing destruction, but how do you intend to do that? The realm feeds off a very specific type of energy. Energy born of battle. Despite the best of my efforts, however, I have yet to produce it myself. Thus... Thus, you gathered us here completely out of the blue, and against our will. Yes. So that we'd fight each other? Yes. No. <sighs> Leave it to a god to just do as they please. Let us forget the means for a moment. You wish us to help you preserve harmony in this world, do you not? Um, well, uh... Well, what? Yes. Please, for the sake of my world. The sake of your world, you say? <laughs> Chaos? To exist, what a twist. You may call me Spiritus. I am a god, born of dimensional fragments and given form to rule this world. Spiritus? How peculiar. That name I do not know. I do know, however, that I am this land's only keeper.
Continue to think that if you wish. It bothers me not. My might, however, will soon prove you wrong. This is a cruel world, and it can only be tamed by a crueler heart. <laughs> that is not true. <laughs> you, you could not be more wrong. <laughs> Okay. Um. Huh? I hate to butt in here, but do you think I can ask how we get back home? You may not. No. Oh. I beseech you, defeat Spiritus. That will be all. Our questions are many. One thing, however, is clear. Materia requires our strength to achieve her objective. Then she shall have it. For now, anyway. Wait, for now? As he said, there's much we don't know. Is there now? We would do well to move forward with caution. Regardless, action shall prove more fruitful than idleness. Materia didn't seem to know too much about us. She didn't even seem to know too much about her world, come to think of it. Nor did the two gods seem to know each other. Maybe Spiritus isn't our enemy after all. Maybe not. We need to find out what we're dealing with here. I think I can help with that. You can, huh? Yes. I sense the espers of this realm. They might be able to teach us about Spiritus and Materia. You're going after them, aren't you? That's where you're headed. Whatever. Hmm? Go on, keep making that face. It'll get stuck that way. Uh, then let us come along so it doesn't. <laughs> My old man was there with Spiritus. I saw him. If he's here, I don't care what that girl wants. I won't fight. And here, I thought it was over. Good day, I say. Huh? 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 No! Good day, I say! Hey there. Greetings. <gasps> Children these days are ruder than ever. Yet I'll forgive you for this endeavor. Huh? Are your heads full of bricks? Follow me and be quick. Why? Where to? Simple, my dear. To find a way out of here. I prefer taking the easiest route to my goal. I won't waste time on pointless rigmarole. Uh. <sighs> Hey, Cloud. Hmm? Striking out on your own? It's a one-person job, that's why. No, oh, gotcha. Wouldn't want to hold you up. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. Greetings to you as well, young knight. You must be nervous this being your first time here and all. I'll make sure we find our way home. So don't worry, okay? Yeah, and I'll come oh. along too. You got nothing to fear. Come on. He might be of use to you. <laughs> Fortune could frown deeper for certain. Might I entreat you to act as my guides? We'd be happy to. A realm in which memories can be given form. I must admit I am intrigued. Wait! I'm supposed to take the lead! Hey, I thought we were supposed to be the guides.
Finally, it is within my grasp. The greatest power known to man. The power to control the universe. The power of the void. <sighs> what did you do to them, you bastard? <sighs> <sighs> your name, right? Cloud? Like puffs in the sky? So you remember me. Then you know what's going on. We're back here again? You. What is the meaning of this? I'm trying something. What? Just humor me. Set the world on fire and watch it burn! No time for regrets. What did you do? Don't you worry. Eventually, our goals will align. <laughs> and when they do, we shall meet once again. Get back! 
back here! They'll align? Let's get out of here. This place is gonna crumble. Sure. They'll all be glad to. Uh, uh, uh. Got people waiting on me. Right. Things were not looking too good when I left. And you have no way of speaking with them? Yeah. We are the same. Even now, my allies worry. Hmm. I see we all have a place to call home. Even you? Yes. Even if it did not, though, that would change nothing. I still would have answered her call. Of that, I have little doubt. Sorry you were involved. <sighs> it's not like you're the one to blame. Ever have someone you didn't understand? Hmm? And yet you find that what is important to them suddenly becomes important to you? So that's how he feels? To put it simply. Hmm. Anyways, it's like you said. Nothing's gonna get done if we just stand here. Agreed. <laughs> Cecil. Noctis. Thank you. Think nothing of it. Yeah, um, no worries. Then shall we? We're all in one piece, so that's how it works. Hmm? Noctis. Look. What the? <sighs> Whoa, that's crazy! Our conflict is what spawned this phenomenon. Man, if the guys were here, they'd totally flip it seeing this. Let us press on. We should reach Spiritus soon enough. What is it? Uh, is it another summon? I think so. Maybe we should split up. Uh, I see where you're coming from, but... How far? It's closer than the other one. I'll keep going after this one. What? Hold on! You're gonna go alone? It'll be easier that way. Uh, uh... Don't worry. I won't do anything stupid. Squall! <sighs> Good luck with yours. Thanks. See you huh? soon. Uh, uh, never thought Lightning was the motherly type. Squall's not the only one who needs looking after. <laughs> You're right. Someone needs to keep me in line, too. I'm up to the task. <sighs> Our problem is this force. We need only follow it to the source. She has the appearance of a child. Yeah, and the aura of something from your nightmares. Listen up, Puffs. Uh -huh. <laughs> Are your ears garnish or full of varnish? Uh, uh, Pardon us. We did not mean to ignore you. The 
best cease your prattle once we begin battle. Trap written all over it. And? Care to join me? Your plan may be rather rash, but I'll lead you in this clash. <laughs> Imply this memory belongs to another. <sighs> oh, be careful. I always am. You never know what's out there. <sighs> and he does. No point worrying about Vaughn. He marches to his own beat. <laughs> Such a blithe spirit. That he is. Alright, the coast is clear. So there is caution under all that, Moxie. <laughs> Can you believe it? There's no one here but us. Are you certain? My eyes don't lie. Anyhow, I'm no coward. Huh? The bearer of the memory need not be present for it to manifest. The thing is, it's gotta belong to one of us champions. Hmm. I don't get it. I surmise that Materia employs these microcosms to expand this world. It is to that end we were assembled. In other words, this place was fashioned from the memory of someone she brought here. Oh. You get all that? Hmm. That's wild! Um, yeah. Uh, it is. Imagine! The more people here, the more places to explore! Fascinating indeed. If only she had gathered everyone here. Oh, that's why Materia called so many of us at once. She must like efficiency. Huh? Wait a minute. I thought we were brought here to fight. We were, but the reasons for our assemblage are twofold. Hmm? Our memories are the catalyst by which the world expands, and the energy obtained from our clashes maintains it. And, as we're already here, we only need to think about the accumulating energy part. Okay, so our job's already half over. What? You're oversimplifying things a bit. Come on, there's more to see. Um, uh, okay. Where will we end up next? Oh. They're all right. They're not having long bouts of silence or intense staring contests, are they? <laughs> you don't have to worry about everyone you meet. Oh, 
disposal. Yep, we're back. Don't worry. We're not here to fight. We need to know more about the gods who rule here. They are a bit wet around the ears, to say the least. The will of Cosmos and Chaos? But why? Because so many people have fond memories of it. You mean, even Spiritus? <sighs> Don't tell me. We've been after the wrong guy this whole time? What are they? You do know, don't you? Are you saying this world is doomed no matter how much we fight? We'll just have to do something about it then, won't we? You can't be... There's no running from this. Oh. You're right. We can't run. But we can't do it alone. Help us destroy these planes, Gorgers. Together, we can bring this world back from the brink of destruction. I know you care about this world too. Just roll over and die.
If you don't work as a team, you're nothing. Do not interfere. Enough's enough. Let's wipe out these worlds with one fell blow. I'm quite sure you'd consent to that, right, Alti? Oh, how delightfully devilish those horns look on you. That would release plenty of energy. Tidus, are you harmed? Yeah. Whew. I thought you'd never come. To be on the menu at such a grand venue. <laughs> I'll say it straight, we were their bait. We were? They forgot that since I'm on your team, we'll foil their crude scheme. You think to keep the gate from being prized open? You've both the garb of a jester and the wit of one. I could laugh at you for days before being done. <laughs> now be good boys and girls and lay your heads down to rest. Leave opening the gate to one who can do it with zest. You wish to swoop in and steal our thunder. I'm saying I've made it my mission to bring your failed plan to fruition. You're so full of yourself, you're bursting at the seams. It's no wonder everyone gives you a wide berth. Confusing yourself with others now, are we? I can't fathom how wretched your life must be. My condolences on the loss of your hearing. <laughs> but such is old age. More like your mind is so infantile that even listening proves a trial. Is that so? Now I want those cavalier lips of yours kissing dirt. In due time, you shall come to room, biting off more than you can chew. Or you will rue misjudging me. I'll play fair. Fairly dirty, that is. It'd be prudent to treat my teammates as students. Well done. You've earned your day in the sun.
on my wood. Now we push on. Wait, what? And just let it go? Well, not upon it. Cecil is correct. The fruit our battle bore seems to have withered against that light. We've seen this destroyer of dimensions before, and it went by many a sonorous name. Whatever the name, it burdens materia. And us, for certain. Perhaps the time has come for us to reconsider who our enemy truly is. Kill me now. Hmm? Oh. Hey, what do you think huh? you're doing? What have we here? <laughs> Ask a dumb question and... You get a dumb answer! Mayhap you know him? Afraid so. My home. No. I see! <sighs> then I'll destroy it! How does that make you feel? Angry, maybe? I bet it's angry! Vaughn! Don't let him get to you! I know, and I know this isn't the real Robin Oster, but still! Feast your eyes on this, ladies and gentlemen! Have you no morals to revel in the destruction of another's homeland? That shall serve as ample reason to strike you down. <laughs> You'll eat those words. Now be good! We all know what happens to naughty boys and girls! We shall show them. We are not to be trifled with.
I must say I performed admirably today. Alrighty, that should do it. Faster. Oh no! It's the plane scorchers! Whatever will we do? Well, I know what I'll be doing. Leaving. Hey, wait! Hey. We walked right into his trap. At this juncture, no amount of energy will avail us. We just let the world get consumed? It's all vanishing before our eyes. To think that others have gone the same way as well. <sighs> what a shame. There has to be something we can do. Right, Yashtola? At the moment, there is but one recourse. Then let's do it! We must retreat. Materia needs to know what's been happening. She'll know better than us how to put a stop to this. Fiends, the devour dimensions. this don't know these portals have been sneaky over here gilda geese greens the next one takes us back so uh i'm glad you didn't forget about me <laughs> i did for a bit <laughs> oh you're breaking my heart sorry Always the consummate gentleman. And you remember... Actually... I even remember what I had for dinner last night. And everything from the last time I was here. Before, it was all a blur. Uh, I know what you mean. I'll bet that's not the only thing that's different. How are we supposed to get home this time? In that respect, nothing's changed. We fight to create energy. Then Materia can... Uh, Materia? She's the new Cosmos. Come on, I'll explain while we walk. So, it's close by now? Oh. Oh. <laughs> hmm. You two are more perceptive than you look. Hey, buddy, we're kinda on a date here. Can we do this later? Which of the summons do you seek? <laughs> Names elude you, then. No matter. There is no power too great to serve me. is admirable, but alas, once we have what we seek, we shall dispose of you. You're free to try, but look! They're on our side! Feckless, please. <laughs> so sorry. Wouldn't want you dying too soon. Good. You have some life left in you. There is no one to help you now. It would seem that is my cue. Traitor! Oh. 
on your feet. If you would dance, then allow me to take the lead. <laughs> Alas, my partners have two left feet. Shut it! Wouldn't want to keep our audience waiting. Right. Let's go. With rehearsal done, now the production can begin. <laughs> Only I am worthy of wielding this scepter. They won't even see me coming. so soon? Let us quit this place. by the skin of our teeth. Luckily. Uh. Uh. Hmm. <clears throat> you are to speak or be gone from my sight. Come with us. Huh? if we'd ever meet again. Now that we have time for a proper conversation, how about it? You're not gonna say no to a lady, are you? I would not, if it is Her Majesty's desire. You 
were the one who broke Kefka's spell over me, right? My memory is a bit hazy. Without you, I could never gain control of myself. Oh, luckily you were rescued then. I really mean it. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. <sighs> Jet. Ain't you lively? <laughs> I keep you waiting long? Ha! We're not waiting for an old man. Looks like this old man needs to save your butts. <laughs> Damnable sky serpent. Learn some manners. This boat's ill. Shantoto is gone. What? She is? Where'd she go? One of you is missing? Why must every single person meddle in my plans? If that baby's gonna drag us into his tantrum. Okay then, let's start the second half. Let's teach them a thing or two, or three! Follow the ace and we'll get a win. Not the only thing I'm good at. Are we inside the gateway? That we are. It was here that my quest first began. And you have been to that castle? Indeed. The princess had been spirited away, and I pledged my sword to her rescue. However, what awaited us... <laughs> Do you remember me? You were lucky enough to defeat me once. Garland, how did I know you would be here? Interesting. I could say the same thing to you. Fate seems set on having us 
cross swords evermore. Even though we are no longer bound by time, we are still bound by destiny to fight! Uh, uh -huh. Cecil, Noctis, let us oblige him. <laughs> You're the boss. <laughs> How will you fare against armed opponents? I'll admit you have the courage, but have you the wits? us with your almighty bolts! Not a failure. <laughs> you owe me an answer. Is Spiritus the one sapping this world's life force? Nonsense. He is a successor of the old gods and deeply bound to this place. He desires not its destruction. If he speaks true, then we are only wasting our efforts. You're correct. We must return at once and apprise Materia um, of- Um, hold up. Uh, huh? Uh, so, um, well, we don't have to go all the way back there. What do you mean? Remember how Materia and Spiritus could communicate in real time back at her dome? Could just use whatever they did, not like Spiritus will attack us. All we gotta do is ask. It'll save us time, I'm sure of it. That may work, if Spiritus will let us. Hmm. He is not so single-minded as to let a petty few cloud his better judgment. Then our next destination has been decided. That was an ingenious solution, Noctis. No problem. Uh, just one thing. Hmm? How about you call me Noct instead? It's no use. We're just going around in circles. Let's sit here. We can wait for help. You know darn well where we are. No one's ever gonna drop by. Huh? Oh. Ah! Uh. Why did that infernal gateway have to open and lead me astray? On an excursion? What a quaint diversion. Uh, uh, <laughs> you're in high spirits, all things considered. Think you can get us back to Materia? Oh. If not, who would I be? A peon without pedigree. 
<laughs> Thank the stars! Looks like it's our lucky day. Just one question. Who is she? An ally. She knows her way around this place. Enough to escape. We should hurry. Gotta see how things are. It won't hold! Time to leave this dump for greener pastures, not you! <laughs> Vanish along with this world. Coming? Uh, should take a look around first. All right. Well, see you around. Yeah. See you later. Show me the ropes around here, little one. If you would but look around, you would see there is no need for that. Would it have been anywhere else? Alexander, excuse me, but we have something to... <sighs> what the heck? Hear us out, please! We mean you no harm! Can't get near him! <laughs> Perhaps it was a mistake for me to come here. What? <laughs> Sadly, my presence here only nettles him. You wish. Get over yourself. This isn't like back home. Why else would the Moogles guide us here? Koja, do you know how to calm him down? Your naivete is refreshing, if nothing else. Don't be absurd. Hmm. Such a being will never obey reason. Yet another trial? Good thing my blades are sharp. Only the tritest of twists for this play.
so glad we won. If we hadn't... I'm looking forward to fighting on your side next time. You saved our butts. <laughs> Mere coincidence. Alexander was my goal. Don't just stand there. This place will soon be reduced to nothing. How typical. Kuja, don't be a stranger. Okay. We need to split. <laughs> heading back as well you too yeah we just finished up with a job a job ta-da summons and stuff <laughs> I imagine felling beings much like the primals was harrowing it was no sweat and you I had a great time there was danger around every corner this isn't some field trip, Vaughn. It's serious. Uh, well, we found out a lot, too. Apparently, Plains Gorgers are running amok all over. Aye, and have wrought much destruction. They sup on the force we seek to amass, threatening this world's balance. It could founder ere long. Huh? Oh. <laughs> uh, hey, listen up. This is important. <sighs> but not enough for Squall? That's how it is. We'll need to change our priorities. Just so everyone knows, Materia and Spiritus were created from Cosmos's desire to keep this world safe. Huh? Uh huh? I also want to make sure this world is safe. Lots has happened to me here. Maybe not all of it good, but that doesn't make this place any less important. <laughs> Without this world, we couldn't see each other anymore. I don't want that. Because we barely know anything about each other's home worlds. Hmm. To arms, then. This land has suffered the presence of these voracious dragons over long. So you're the famous Materia. Pleased to meet you. I had heard tell of a lost warrior, and was quite taken aback. Thankfully, you managed to find your way to my side, hale and hearty. Before you celebrate, I've got some bad news. <sighs> Although your journey began some time ago, the world's heart now beats faintly as ever. Mayhap Spiritus's minions proved overly formidable? No, not quite. If only! Some things are guzzling down our energy for themselves, the same ones that were doing it before! If you know the cause of our ails, then why not excise it? More powerful than us, your ignorance puts me to a non-plus. Yes! Oh. Don't waste the last drops of our precious time gawking! The situation demands we begin talking! Uh. 
gawking. Was I gawking? Huh? What are you asking me for? Do you mean to turn my champions against me? Save your quarrelsome posturing for another time, Materia. As even fragments of the beast take this form, our travails will persist until we kill it outright. Seems like wherever we go, there they are. Our path's home are blocked as long as it draws breath. Another reason it deserves a quick death. Did you know of this, Spiritus? Did you stand idly by while the world's lifeblood was siphoned away? I knew as little as you, and there is no shame in that. If we are to grow, however, we must ensure that our world grows with us. Very well. Then I have a request. Warriors of distant worlds, lend us your strength and your skill. Pull this realm out from the mire of combat. The light will always be with us. To cast off the chains that bind us to the cycle, we must make our stand! Our common enemy is none other than the Plain Scorcher. Whether we be gods or their champions... <laughs> What's gotten into him? We may have our differences, but in this world, we are one! <laughs> For the time being. Right. Don't think you're forgiven. <laughs> this world is pretty cool after all. Let's meet up again, once things calm down. <sighs> draws near. We must needs act with haste. Got it. Let's do this. <laughs> Nary a more capable band of champions exists. Of that, I harbor little doubt. Go forth. And prevail! Come <laughs> on. 
savage beast deserves a savage end.
Huh? You had best not forget. Without my warriors, all hope of defeating Shinryu would have been lost. True. I swallowed my pride for this. And I never thought you would. I had no other choice. I simply employed the only means available. Do not embellish your own importance. What I did, I did for... The, the sake, sake of, of the, the world. world. <sighs> I have no qualms with that. The world must be restored, no matter the toll it is to take on us. Then, once it finally has... I will vanquish you. Hmm. Perfect. I expected no less from you. Could these be... memories? Parting gifts. If so, I bequeath the vestiges of my power to each of you. Yes. Let us begin it all anew. Begin our own clash. Show me no mercy. Fret not, for you deserve none. I will have you bend the knee. It shall be your knee that bends, not mine. We grant you the service of our champions. To serve in your beck and call.